So to test this fan-requested tall tale of gummy bear-powered propulsion, let's get things rolling with our resident rocket scientist. The only difference between this hybrid rocket and the one we'll be making is that ours will be powered by delicious, delicious candy. Mm. This is the rocket engine liner. Now we're going to fill this with gummy bear. Shove your candy in that hole. Everything about a rocket burning is about controlling the burn. And when you have too much surface area, that burn can get out of control. And really, its failure mode is to blow up your rocket. And that's bad. The system is armed, theoretically. All right, prediction time. Loose gummy rocket motor? I don't think it's going to work that awesome. There it goes. We have ignition. So when you decode the altimeter, it says that our gummy bear rocket got up to 3,691 feet. That's pretty respectable.